Well, this year, a lot of people are focusing on what brings them joy. Joining us now is someone who brings a lot of joy around the world. It's the CEO of Norwegian Cruise Line, Andy Stewart. Good morning to you. Good morning, how are you? Thanks for having me. I'm doing great and I'm so excited to um, share this program that you guys are doing. This is super exciting. This entire Giving Joy campaign, I think is something every single person needs to li uh, listen up for because we're gonna wanna nominate someone. Tell us a little bit about it. So our newest ship to the North American market, Norwegian Joy is uh, uh, sailing out of Seattle first week of May to Alaska. And uh, we're super excited about that, but that happens to be the uh, same week as Teacher Appreciation Week, and we didn't feel we could, we could let that go by. So the combination of Norwegian Joy and Teacher Appreciation Week, we felt we should um, say thank you to the folks that shape the hearts and minds of uh, all of our children. So we're gonna ask your viewers and folks around the country to nominate a teacher or teachers who've been truly inspirational with children, who've changed lives, who've done something that really um, you know, moved, moved a child or children forward uh, in a special way. And uh, we are then gonna reward 15 of those teachers with a seven day cruise anywhere we sail, Europe, Alaska, Hawaii, Bermuda, the Caribbean, uh, anywhere we're offering a seven day cruise. So we're very excited. Giving joy is something that we think is gonna be quite special. I think it's very special. I already know who I want to nominate as well, and I think a lot of people listening will too. Why put such a big spotlight on educators? I think everybody knows a teacher or someone that's inspired them, but why was it so important to you to combine that travel and education element? You know, I do think, and obviously educators are shaping the, the minds of uh, our children and they are the future. So it, it really is all about the future and giving our children the very best opportunity to, to make the best of their futures and, and everyone's futures. So I, I, I sort of start there. And, and travel is really at the heart of uh, education, I think. The two intertwine in a, in a way that's inseparable and the combination of travel and, and education is, uh, is the one that gets the best outcome, I always think. It's so true. I think the more you can travel, the more you expand your knowledge of the world and of people, the more we become more inclusive, which is so important as well. So how do people nominate? What do they need to do to take part of this Give Joy campaign? Because to be able to nominate one of those teachers and hopefully have one of those be our 15 winners, what do we do? So we want to hear the stories and to tell the stories, we're asking your viewers to go to nclgivingjoy.com. That's nclgivingjoy.com. And there they'll have the opportunity to write the story about the teacher or teachers who really have been inspirational. Uh, and, uh, and also your viewers can go there to vote for teachers who've been nominated. So um, we, wanna, we really want to hear the stories. Go to nclgivingjoy.com. It's cool. I'm excited to read some. I'm excited to nominate some as well as other people are, I'm sure. Um, and this culminates then in Seattle on May 3rd, right, where these teachers can actually win money for their school. That's right. So we're going to have a big event to, to celebrate the, uh, the 15 winners in uh, Seattle on May 3rd, as you say. And, uh, and there, there will be the opportunity for one teacher to take $15,000 of funding back to, back to their school. So 15 teachers get to sail on a seven day cruise and one school gets $15,000 of funding. Pretty cool. For the rest of us non-educators or those who will not win the contest, where do you suggest that we take a cruise to? If we can only take one cruise in our lifetime, where should we go? Oh, you can't only take one cruise in your lifetime. My favorite cruise, I must say, is Alaska. Uh, we had a fantastic family cruise in Alaska, but we also cruised the Med out of Barcelona and went to Rome and Florence and Pisa and Naples, went to Pompeii. Uh, we've had wonderful Caribbean cruises, so my best advice is don't limit yourself to one cruise. I love it. Thanks so much for joining us, Andy. What a cool campaign. Wonderful. Thanks for having me. You're welcome. That website, again, is nclgivingjoy.com.